Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Themis or Tracked Hybrid Modular Infantry System is an unmanned ground vehicle designed largely for military applications and built by Milram Robotics in Estonia. The vehicle is intended to provide support for dismounted troops by serving as a transport platform, remote weapons station and IED detection etc. Themis which has been making waves in the military technology sector, has been recently procured by Indian Army. It has also been purchased by 16 other countries, 8 of which are members of NATO, including United States, United Kingdom, Spain, Norway, Netherlands, Germany, France and Estonia. The Milram Robotics has recently announced that German Ministry of Defense has ordered 14 of its Themis unmanned ground vehicle to be sent to the Ukrainian forces for immediate use for casualty evacuation and for finding and removing landmines and similar devices and it will not be armed. As per reports, Russia's Center for Analysis of Strategies and Technology CAST has offered a cash reward for the capture of Themis unmanned ground vehicle and hopes to use a captured Themis to accelerate the development of Russia's technology in this area. Talking about the capabilities of Themis, the UGV weighs around 1630 kg and can carry a rated payload of 750 kg and maximum payload of 1200 kg. It has hybrid power option that is it can power by diesel as well as by electricity and can operate up to 15 hours on hybrid power and 1 to 5 hours on electric power. It can operate from a range of 1 to 5 kilometers in line of sight. It has maximum speed of 20 kilometers per hour. It also features IR, thermal and SDR camera and IP radio. The UGV is base platform which can be integrated with multiple sensors depending upon the type of mission. For example, Themis motor carrier can be adjusted to accommodate a motor up to 81 mm. It can also be cubed with light remote weapon stations to increase the firepower in addition to easing the workload of combatants. It has been integrated with variety of remote control weapon stations such as Guardian 2.0, Adder DM, Protector from Kongsberg and Defender from FN Hustel. The Themis Combat with Hero 120 by Univision can be equipped by 6 lottering munition system that will provide dismounted inventory and special forces units with long range ISR and fire power combination. Ideal for anti tank missions or other strategic objectives, the Hero 120 is the largest Univision's short range system. It carries 3.5 kg warhead and can endure an extended flight time of 60 minutes. Themis has also been integrated with Terahawk unmanned counter UA system. From the capability wise, Themis is a versatile platform which can carry remote control weapon stations, motors, lottering munition, and can even act as counter UAS system. In the same segment, the Gridbots, a technology company from India and works in the field of robotics, artificial intelligence, and machine vision, has also offered an unmanned ground vehicle to Indian Army. Recently, the Gridbots, Titan, and Zeus has participated in Operation Dakshin Shakti conducted by Indian Army with Indian Army's tank and BMPs. The Gridbots Titan is a multi-utility combat vehicle which can autonomously perform multiple types of operations in the battlefield without any human assistance or intervention thereby minimizing the risk for the infantry and enhancing their capabilities on ground. It can be used for unmanned and autonomous conduct of silent real-time day and night surveillance, can support weapon mounts, situational awareness, casualty evacuation, carriage and delivery of operational loads in desert plains in high altitude, especially mountainous terrain. It has a thermal sight with 360 degree of panoramic view and two-way radio communication. The robot weighs around 1000 kg and has a payload capacity of 1500 kg. It has speed of 20 km per hour and 45 degree climbing capability. The robot has an operational range of 20 km and can operate in autonomous manual follow me mode. 
We can also see a Moog 3 anti tank guided missile by BDL mounted on this robot. The Titan weighs lesser than Themis but still can carry higher payload. Titan is still undergoing trials with an Indian army and has potential to compete with Themis. Titan will have to match up with the versatility of Themis and support variety of payloads. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.